Warthog Games Limited was a UK-based video game developer, located in Cheadle Holm, Stockport, with studios in Sweden and the USA. The developer later developed titles as Gizmondo Europe, before the company disbanded, and key staff formed Embryonic Studios which later became TT Fusion but relaunched by CFAO as Warthog Entertainment. History Warthog was founded in April 1997, the core of the development team composed of ex-electronic arts personnel responsible for, amongst other titles, the hit Privateer 2, The Darkening. With this as the basis, Warthog began to develop something of a speciality in space flight sims, with follow-up title Star Lancer which sold over 330,000 units, mainly on PC and Star Trek, Invasion achieving over 230,000 units on PlayStation. Since 1999, the company also developed expertise in children's titles, with releases based upon well-known franchises such as Tom and Jerry, Looney Tunes, Harry Potter and Asterix. In later years, Warthog purchased several other companies. First, in 2002, they purchased Atad, which became Warthog Sweden. Also in 2002, they purchased Z2. Then in 2003, they purchased US-based Fever Pitch, which became Warthog Texas. In 2004, Warthog itself was acquired by Tiger Telematics and became a part of Gizmondo Studios. Collectively, the Cheadle and newly acquired Sweden Studios became known as Gizmondo Europe, with the recently acquired Warthog Texas becoming Gizmondo Texas. Their focus from then on would be on the Gizmondo handheld console. After Gizmondo went bankrupt, key staff from the original team established a new development company, Embryonic Studios. This company was then acquired by TT Games in 2006, and renamed TT Fusion, where the team continued to develop console and handheld titles. Warthog were affiliated with the Manchester Metropolitan University course Computer Games Technology. They provided feedback on course content and a selection of placement jobs for third-year students. List of games. Topic cancelled titles Battlebots Mama Can I Mow the Lawn Johnny Whatever X10 Conquest 2, The Virium Uprising Wrath and Skeller Fallen Kingdoms Battlebots was a video game based on the Battlebots license for PlayStation 2 and GameCube. It got fairly far in development. Many screenshots were released to media outlets and it obtained a rating from the ESRB, but it was ultimately cancelled after the show was cancelled. However, prototypes of the game were sold on the BattleBots website for $299.98. Additionally, photographic evidence of the game being played proves that there are copies in existence, so the game could be brought to the internet in the form of a ROM. It has been the dream of lead designer Zubi Ahmed to one day recreate this cancelled game. Mama Can I Mow the Lawn is a video game which started off in development for formats such as the PlayStation 2, but after the developer Warthog Games was purchased by Tiger Telematics to produce titles for the Gizmondo handheld console, it was moved to the Gizmondo. Tiger Telematics went bankrupt in 2006 when the Gizmondo was discontinued, and the status of this game is publicly unknown. It was most likely cancelled. Johnny Whatever was announced on July 20, 2004, but was later cancelled. It was planned as an action game in a third-person environment, following a punk hero in a futuristic city who used his guitar as his weapon against villains. It started off in development for the PlayStation 2 and Xbox, but became a Gizmondo exclusive when the developer was purchased by Tiger Telematics, makers of the Gizmondo. The game was scheduled for a September 2006 release. A demo for the Gizmondo was made, but it was never released. Upon liquidation of Tiger Telematics and their UK subsidiary Gizmondo Europe in February 2006, the ownership of Johnny Whatever was sold back to the CEO of Warthog Games. <laughs> 